What's up guys, The Flying Tech here. Today we're going to be checking out the Heliway 903, courtesy of GearBest. So let's get right into it. Alright guys, here is everything that comes in the kit. You get the quad itself, a proprietary battery, an extra set of props, a USB charging cable, a metal prop puller, a set of prop guards, a TX, and an instruction manual. All right, guys, as usual, let's start with the quad. Not too heavy at all, actually kind of light, a lot lighter than I was expecting. The Heliway comes with eight millimeter brushed motors. This little quad's gonna have some kick to it, I can tell you that. On the box, it says it goes 45 kilometers an hour, and I'm pretty sure it probably does. Okay guys, so this is the non-altitude hold model, which I think is the way better choice when it comes to buying these. Also, if you'll notice, there is no camera here on the front. This is a cameraless bird. The battery slides into the back like so and locks right into place. I will say that one thing I did not like about this was getting the battery in and out. It's actually a lot harder to do with your hands. I find that using the prop puller pulls it right out. As you can see, it was a little difficult, even with the prop puller. The battery, this is a 600 mAh proprietary battery. As you can see, they've got it encased so that it fits into the quadcopter. Uh, but it does come with a standard end here. I'm pretty sure you can probably modify this and put a different battery in it if you so choose. Depending on your flight style, you'll get between five and seven minutes of flight time out of this, which is not bad at all and charge time you're looking at about 35 minutes or so. All right, so we'll go over the TX really quick. This button here is for headless mode. This button here is to turn the light on and off on the quad, and I'll show you that right now. You can turn the lights on and off if you so choose. Save battery or whatever have you. These two buttons here are for taking pictures and video, which this bird doesn't have a camera, so those are of no use. Again, this not being the altitude hold, I can put the throttle up and down as I choose. These buttons here are for your trim. You've got a flip button here that you press in to do flips. This model does front flips, back flips, and left and right flips as well. This here is a dial for actually dialing in the different uh, speed settings or rate settings. I haven't seen one of these before where it's a dial, but whatever, it's fine, it works. The TX itself is very nice. I have to say I'm very impressed. It's like a hobby grade TX. It has a very nice kind of like a, almost like a, a velvet on it. It feels very nice to the touch. And overall, it's a really nice TX for what you're paying for it. All right, guys, that's pretty much it. Next thing to do is take it in the field to test her out. So I'll meet you there. All right, we're gonna turn it on. We're gonna turn on the TX. And now we're bound. Let's go for a flight. That's a low yaw rate. You can see it's pretty hard to handle in the uh, lower settings. Here's a little bit faster now. Not bad. There's the yaw, a little bit faster. Still a little hard to handle. Oof, that's a lot faster. You can see it's a lot more limber now. Let's do a flip. There you go. Let's do another flip. Recovers excellent. Let's do a back flip. And a front flip. Excellent. Now it's on its fastest setting. Look at that. Oof. Wow. This thing is fast. Little funnels there for you. Wow. Thing flies real nice. All right, let's try a punch out. Ready? Here we go. Not bad. This is one of the fastest brushed flyers I've ever flown. Let's try another punch out, ready? Okay, not bad.
Look how fast it is. Wow. I highly recommend this one, guys. This is a fun flyer for sure. Yep. Definitely worth the buy. I would definitely buy this one. It's like a little hummingbird. Just kind of hovers perfectly. I love it. All right, guys, let's land her. There you go. Final thoughts. So my final thoughts on this quarter, it's awesome. It's a great, stable flyer, very responsive, turns on a dime, definitely worth the price. Um, it's fast, it's totally zippy. I actually like the fact that this did not come with a camera because I could put my own camera on here, so I feel like that would just be a wasted feature for me. I highly recommend putting an all-in-one on here and having a go at it FPV. It's definitely a lot of fun. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed. Hope you found this useful. If you did, please leave a thumbs up. Leave all comments below. We love to get your comments. And with that, as always, happy flying.